All right, so today I am losing my virginity. Hello guys and welcome to another video. So today, what I thought I'd do is I thought I would review Hungry Jacks. Now, I'm sure a lot of you know, or most of you that live in Australia know that Hungry Jacks does have a vegan menu. Me, myself in Canada, we don't have a Hungry Jacks back in Canada. Um, we do have a Burger King, which I believe is the same. They sell Whoppers and all of that. So same company, I'm assuming, but Hungry Jack's is different. And in Canada, at least in Vancouver, where I was, we did not have a vegan menu. So I think when I left Canada, they just brought in the Rebel Whopper, which my understanding isn't 100% vegan. I think you can make it vegan somehow, but here in Australia, you can get a vegan menu or a vegan burger so it actually says it in the title i got the vegan cheeseburger it is a vegan patty or a couple vegan patties actually um large thick cut fries a large coke and yeah i thought i would um i guess rate or give you my rating of how the vegan burger is so here is the vegan burger here. You can see a couple, couple patties in there, some vegan mayonnaise, some cheese, lettuce, tomatoes, the full, the full shindig. So I'm going to eat this. It is going to be, of course, a shorter video today. Didn't really have an idea, but um, here it is. fries the burger is done that was good that was really good um, <clears throat> so the vegan cheeseburger the vegan cheeseburger is what I had from excuse me oh my god <laughs> okay <laughs> sorry the vegan cheeseburger is what I had from Hungry Jack's. Um, first time having this, first time having Hungry Jack's period since I've been here in Australia. I've been here for three months now. First time I've had Hungry Jack's period. I haven't even really had Burger King when I was back in Canada. Um, Cause like I said, they haven't really ever had a vegan option that I know of. Um, I know like they do have the Rebel Whopper um, and I know here at Hungry Jack's they do, but apparently it's not 100% vegan. I can't remember why it wasn't. I think I read it somewhere, but so when I went, uh, when I went into Hungry Jack's today, I saw that they had the vegan burger and they actually have vegan like breakfast um, options and things like that too. So I thought that was really cool. Um, I do hopefully in the future maybe want to do like a full, like I ate nothing but but Hungry Jacks for 24 hours. I love watching those videos. So I thought I'd uh, do that in the future, but oh my God, I haven't had fast food in so long. It's not sitting well, but the burger was really good. Um, the, the One of the problems that I think a lot of vegan burgers have is they're very like mushy inside and they don't really give you that, satis that satisfaction. So like something like the Beyond Meat Burger or even maybe like the Rebel Burger. I don't know if, I don't know what company that is. Maybe is Rebel a company, I don't know, but I'm sure those probably imitate beef. So they probably taste like a real burger. So especially if you're someone who like, who is a meat eater or maybe is transitioning and you're kind of craving that beefy type flavor, then I definitely maybe would go more towards like 
one of those type of burgers, whereas vegan burgers kind of are a lot more like vegetable based and things like that. This burger, yeah, I think it was a little bit more vegetable based, but like it didn't take anything out of the burger. Like it was flavored really well. It had like all of the correct condiments on it, all of the veggies, uh, the vegan mayo. The cheese wasn't overpowering, so that's what I liked about that. Sometimes vegan cheeses are like uh, hit and miss, but this one was this one was pretty good actually. Um, so I really liked that. So I would actually give the burger like a good eight or nine out of ten to be honest. Um, the reason I wouldn't give it a 10 out of 10 is because of that like sogginess. Like there was some sogginess and it was super, super messy. So like it went everywhere. Um, so if, if you're having this like on the go, eating in the car or something, this is probably not the burger for you because it doesn't hold together very well, but it was very good, very tasty. Um, yeah, that's really all I have to say. Um, oh my God, I keep on burping. Yeah, um, sorry. That's really all I have to say. Um, that was a short video, I know. I Like I said, quarantine, not really much to do, but I was just viewing a home and they had like a Hungry Jacks across the street, which is dangerous, especially if like this is the home that I get. Um, that'll be very dangerous, but thought maybe this could be the first time that I uh, try Hungry Jacks and see how it is and um, didn't mind it at all. So if you're uh, on the market for fast food and you're a vegan, definitely try the vegan cheeseburger. It's very good. I really liked it. Uh, I definitely am going to hopefully try the vegan um, breakfast sausages next time. Um, yeah. Thank you all for watching. Be sure to please hit that subscribe button. My goal is 500 subscribers by the end of the year, which I know doesn't sound like a lot. I know there's people like Jeffree Star who has like, what, 50 million now, or I don't, I don't know, but I know 500 isn't a, isn't a lot compared to there, but it's something. So hit that subscribe button. It takes three seconds um, and I will see you next time. Thanks. Oh, 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 oh,